Hi guys, welcome once again to the channel. In our last video, we talked about how we can add an image into a text. And we ended up doing this. So in this video, we would be taking this particular um, add an image into a text. We're taking it to another level and we're going to be adding a video into a text. So just like we have an image in this particular text here, we're going to be taking a look at how we can add a video into a text. So I have created um, another project for this and over here I have the word cars over here and this is actually where we want to show a specific video. So let's take a look at the code. So in the code over here we have uh, HTML and our HTML is pretty basic and um, we have a video tag over here which is actually going to be the video that we will be showing within this particular text over here. So we have a video, we have an H1 tag and this H1 tag is in a div. So let's take a look at what we did um, to be able to accomplish the style. So first off we actually imported this font which was the same font we used in our previous video so if you haven't watched our previous video just click on the card over here to watch that so um let's see here we actually styled our body just to give it some family fonts um fonts family you meant to say we gave it a pattern zero margin zero so we actually included our video here um we styled up our video just to give the width a width of 100 percent and for that of the div we said that the div should have a position of fix now what we are trying to do here is that we are trying to bring this particular div over this video tag so the video already has a width of 100 percent which is great so we're trying to bring this particular div here over the video and let me explain what's going on here so like you can see we actually have this div here. The div has the um, background color of black. And if we should take away this div, I'm just going to delete this element. You can see we have our video over here. And if I should undo that, you can see that the div is actually over, um, it's actually over the video. So let's see um, some other things that we did over there. And here we set our background color should be black. And this is just the styling of our fonts. After we've done all this, it's time for us to make the video to show up within the text that we have on this particular web page. So to do that, we would be making use of one CSS property, which is known as Mix Blend Mode. So we'll come over to um, our div selector over here. So we're going to say Mix Blend Mode, Mix Blend Mode, and then we are going to say Darken. We said Darken, and you're going to know why we said that just in the GFE. Like you can see here, we have the video playing within the text that we have within this text of cars. So this is just what we have here. But how exactly is this working? What the mix blend mode does, especially when we use the value of dark, is that it takes preference with the darker color. And by that, it's going to ensure that every dark color in, on the web page shows up. In this case, our background is actually black in this case and black is like the absolute dark color that we have why white is like the absolute light color that we have over here so it's, it's trying to ensure that um our black background here kept on showing why the white of our text like you can see we actually said um our color here should be white why the white of our text became became transparent and as such it gave room for what is underneath the particular div to show up because the white part of our, of our div is actually transparent in this case. If you remember, in the last video, we talked about how we can make a kind of an overlay over the, um, over the image showing within our text. And we're just going to do a similar thing over here. So what we're going to do in this case is that we will change our color to be red. And you can see that we have this kind of a red overlay over the over the video so what um basically happening here is that the red color is that the mixed blend mode of this particular div is trying to blend up the red color of our text with the background with the with the video that is at the background of this particular div so it's kind of, it's kind of mixing them up together and the result is actually what we have over here so if we go back to change the text color back to something else let's say we want to make the red a little bit darker 
like you can see, it happens to be that the video is already fading out. So that is because of this particular red color that we have at this point. It's been close to being an absolute black. And remember that we use the value of dark. So it's always going to take preference with the darker color because we are using the value of darken rather. So we use the value of darken over here. So that simply means to take preference with the darker color. So if we, and by preference, I simply means that the darker color would tend to show, um, would tend to show more than what is on the background. So that is basically what's happening here. If we should come over here and we try to make this black, 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 and you can see we don't even have the video showing up again. It's actually showing up a little bit, but not very much. But if we should make this to be a little bit lighter, you can see over here, we have our video showing up over there. So to make this to show the exact video that we want it to show, we just need to make it um, an absolute light color like we have over here. So this is it on, um, on the value darken. So let's take a look at what, um, at some other values that we have over here. We're going to take a look at this and we're going to say, first we have colors and these are just what happen when we use colors. It's kind of mix up the two colors we have over there. And you can see that the color of the video is not really what it actually used to be. And one important one I would like to show you is actually the lighting. Now the lighting is the exact opposite of the, of the darken. And in this case, what we have here is that it's taking preference with the lighter color now. Now you can see that we have the lighter color like the cars, the color of the cars, of the text cars. We can see that it is actually written in white, like usual, but the darker part of our web page, which is the black part, let me close this, the darker part of our web page, which is the, which is the our background, the dark background, is actually transparent at this point, giving room for the background video to show up. So this is just actually how we can use the CSS blend mode. And you can actually play with this to be able to achieve whatsoever you want to achieve. So I'm going to take this back to darken and close it. And let me just add some little more text over here to see how this goes. So I'm just going to duplicate this several times and we can, okay, maybe I should add a kind of a line height. Um, probably add more line heights of, let's just say a thousand. Okay. So, okay. I think I have, I think I have an overflow of hidden. So over here, I'm just going to say an overflow Y, an overflow Y of auto, and I'm going to save this. So you can see what's going on here. We actually have this text moving and we just have the video being positioned at the background of this particular text. So this is all about using mixed blend mode to show a video within a text. So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you do enjoy this video, remember to give this a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to this channel. Until next time, bye-bye for now.